You're walking through the school. There's no one around and your phone is dead. Out of the corner of your eye, you spot him. Mr. Lloyd. He's following you, about 30 feet back. He gets down on all fours, breaks into a sprint. He's gaining on you. Mr. Lloyd. You're looking for your bag, but you're all turned around. He's almost upon you now, and you can see there's blood on his face. My God, there's blood everywhere! From Mr. Lloyd's, he's brushing his It's Mr. Lloyd's, looking in the shadows. Are we teacher, Mr. Lloyd's, living in the woods? Mr. Lloyd's, he's Mr. Lloyd's, eating all the body. Actual cannibal, Mr. Lloyd's. Now it's dark, and you seem to have lost him. But you're hopelessly lost yourself. Stranded with a murderer. You creep silently through the canteen. Aha! In the distance, a small classroom with a light on. Hope. Oh. You move stealthily toward it. But your leg, ah! It's caught in a bed! Going off the leg! Quiet, quiet. Living towards the cottage! Quiet, quiet. Now you're on the doorstep! Sitting inside, Mr. Lloyd's. Jumping an axe, Mr. Lloyd's. But he doesn't be right now, Mr. Lloyd's. Sticking it behind him. You limp into the dark woods. Blood oozing from your stump leg. You've beaten Mr. Loins. His head topples to the floor, expressionless. You fall to your knees and catch your breath. You're finally safe from Mr. Loin.